What's going on, guys? I'm sitting here with uh, Neverwake here at uh, Innovation Studios in Steubenville, Ohio. Uh, you want to introduce yourselves and say what you play? James, guitar. John, lead vocals and guitar. George, bass. And your drummer is not present because he is what? Making pizza. Pizza. Saw. Okay. Pizza. Saw. Yeah. But um, we're here at Innovation Studios with Mike Gawka in the other room. This is our last day of recording. Um, we're kind of just mixing down all the tracks and going through and making sure they're all right. Now, I know you guys are thinking, where'd they get these cool skin wrapping papers? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I know you guys are thinking, where'd they get these cool appearance modifiers? Why don't you tell them, guys? <laughs> I already know what you guys are thinking. Where'd they get these cool torso applications? Why don't you tell them? It's American Morgan. You gotta check them out on Facebook. Check them out on Twitter. They got a website, www.americanmulligan.com. Uh, go out, check them out. Really cool, really comfortable, great stage gear. So, represent. <clears throat> Right now, you guys want to talk about um, your album you're working on right now, about to finish up? Yeah, it's really a uh, big step from our last demo. Um, it's really, we wanted to, you know, go a little bit on, we wanted to enter the metal side a little bit. In the last album, it was a little bit more rock oriented. It's like, you know, we had a harder tone to it. It was like kind of like a Godsmack feel, but now we're getting into like, this album can stretch from Godsmack to like Bowl for My Valentine to anywhere. You know, it's a lot harder. We also moved up to uh, Drop C to kind of cleaned up all the money that yeah. we had a Drop E from the demo. So it's exactly. a lot cleaner, it's a lot more present. Yeah, it sounds a lot better. It gives the tone a nice quality too instead of our strings rattling. So it's a lot of basics for them. Yeah, it's really cool. It kicks. Um, yeah, Marcus, thing Marcus just... broke two kick pedals during this album, so that'll tell you how much uh, double kick action we got going. Yeah, one thing we really incorporated in this album is a, like a great improvement on our kicks. Um, you know, that's one of our signature things that we like. You know, we like to concentrate on, concentrate on like complex, uh, you know, kick patterns. Sorry, Marcus. Yeah, that's really it's it's funny because like our. Um, like our working titles of like the songs, some of them are called Sorry Marcus and like Marcus, Marcus is, is gonna, gonna kill, kill us. <laughs> yeah, and they're just called like, you know, I really feel bad because this is gonna hurt Marcus because they're just terrible on his feet and just like we said, he broke two pedals. Yeah, but he's been working really hard and he's practicing them, he's getting them all down. Yeah. He did, he did them all perfect on the album, so. We've also been incorporating some uh, arpeggios and sweeps into the, uh, you know, the new songs getting a little bit more complex within the uh, riffs, and um, it's just all falling. It's definitely a, a lot more technical now. Oh yeah, there's, there's a lot of layering too. We've been doing a lot of orchestra, um, vocals, like yeah, harmonies. We don't necessarily want to go out our way to have a keyboardist or you know somebody in our in the band. So we're gonna be doing some sampling because it's really what we have is not that complex. We're not gonna have a keyboard of, like on yeah. the stage to go. Dun, 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 but it, it helps it helps the layering out a lot. Yeah, it helps and it adds a lot of flavor to the music and we feel like it needs to be there. If we didn't have it in there you wouldn't get the same effect. So it's really cool. We're just finishing up now, it should be done today, if everything goes as planned. Then we gotta send it off to be mastered. And then it'll be in your ears soon. Yes, I'll be for this darkness again. Breathe the scary pain of my fear.